Hi, I'm Claudia Simpson. I was asked to come down and identify a body. Oh, she can actually help you. Hi, I'm Lily. What was the name of the decedent? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Okay, uh, why don't you fill this out? Claudia. Yes? I knew you'd come. In Clara's condition, especially since we've done everything else, um, this really is the best option. Can we have some more time? Is that okay? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, t take all the time you need. Clara Green, 42, type 1 diabetic, eight weeks post-op from a tumor resection. You know what? No, I'm sorry. I can't listen to the kid today. I would like to hear from the grown-up doctor. <sighs> I don't want to hear from the stupid kid anymore. I want answers. You remember when we talked about how she might not make it through the surgery? Dr. Bailey said she was prepared to roll the dice, but surgery was a gamble. <laughs> Clara rocked it. And if she can do that, she can do anything. Hey, Paige. I thought you left social services. I did. I went to work for a brokerage firm for about six months and decided the money wasn't worth it. So I'm back. Well, good for you. And welcome back. Thank you. Glad to be back. This Zoe Carroll's case is interesting. Well, I think it just got more interesting with you on it. God, I almost forgot it easily. You make me smart. <laughs> Ditto. <laughs> oh, you remember Joe, don't you? Hey, Paige, uh, you back at social services? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So, um, you seeing anybody? Uh, no, I'm a free agent. Oh. Is this agent free tonight? We could catch up. I just happen to be available. Sounds great. How about MC Square today? Perfect. Oh, good. See you then. Okay. What are you smiling about? <laughs> well, I was... I was just remembering our, our adventures rollerblading in Golden Gate Park. Oh. <laughs> Is it too late for apologies? <laughs> no. No, no, no. It's never too late. <laughs> I'll drink to that. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> so, tell me about this recent breakup. Did she dump you or did you dump her? Oh, uh... It was mutual. Is she a bitch? A princess? What? Uh, no, she was a very nice lady. <laughs> <laughs> um, excuse me a second. I, I forgot. I have to make a phone call. It'll just take a minute. I'll be right back. I'm sorry. I have to go to the ladies' room. Frank, this house is not haunted. All old houses make noise. I just know what it sounded like to me. Right, like a little girl crying out for help. It could be. In one of her books, it could be. In reality, it's just the wind blowing across the roof and down the chimney. But I closed the flue last night, remember? I have to get to work. We'll talk about it tonight. All right? I love you. I love you, too. Bye. Get out of my house. Come on. I just wanted to have a little fun. Please! Please! I felt... I felt an extraordinary love for him. I felt I knew him. And what about the man hanging from the tree? What did you feel about him? I only saw his boots. But I felt... sad. Hurt. Abandoned. I don't think I like this. <sighs> Maybe Rosie's right. Maybe he is a ghost, and I should call her mom and have her light some candles. <laughs>